But right now, we've been talking about this one at the Summit Racing Equipment Southern Nationals. Morgan Lucas and Tony Schumacher. Morgan Lucas and Larry Dixon. Morgan Lucas won his very first race right here. Andy won the first race this season, and Larry Dixon has yet to win. Winner here will face Tony Schumacher, who's never won here. Back in the pit area, that's Tony Schumacher on the toe. They'll fall on that car and get it ready to go. And we're about to find out who he will face in the second round. Boy, they get him back quick, too, don't they? Yep. And who will have lane choice. But setting up this match, we talked about Larry struggling and qualifying. Only one of three times he went down the racetrack. But you almost have to throw that all out because right now it's a different day. It's much cooler conditions. Track looks much better. In fact, to the point where Doug Clutt and both Tony Schumacher, they went their best runs of the weekend by four hundredths of a second. So basically, the whole tune have, have changed quite a bit. Morgan Lucas, he's just going to try to get a handle on this with, you know, Dickie Venables and try to really step this thing up. I mean, his best run uh, this weekend was a 396. We know the car is much more capable of that. And, you know, he may be liking this cool weather. So he can get it hooked up and try to give Larry a race. I was talking with Jason McCullough, the crew chief. There he is with uh, Larry Dixon. He was saying that they are now making changes right up to the absolute last second before they hit the fleet box. And the changes come from that man, Alan Johnson, who's got it all in his head. Larry Dixon, a 386, 320 mile an hour pass. Listening to that Dixon radio there for a moment. Well, we talked about the better conditions, but both drivers match their qualifying time. The 386 to a 396. Obviously, that uh, 86 is pretty much walked away from Morgan Lewis. About half track, and that was the difference to advance uh, Larry Dixon to race Tony Schumacher, and Tony Schumacher will have the lane choice.